Hi, my name is Mike Hayden. I'm a uh, consultant orthopaedic hand surgeon at Wrightington Hospital. This presentation is specifically designed for healthcare professionals, and as a result, there may be some uh, intraoperative images that uh, the lay public may find um, uh, of some concern. So please proceed with caution. I'm going to ask a few questions. There'll be a pause uh, for you either to pause the uh, presentation uh, to answer them with colleagues or yourselves with the aid of a book and then be able to proceed on. So this is a plain radiograph of an adult male. Uh, it presents with a six month history of uh, wrist pain and a decreased range of uh, wrist extension. Uh, what, describe to me what you see. Okay, is there a name associated with this condition? Do you know any classifications? In broad principles, uh, can you tell me the treatment options for this patient? Next question. Uh, this is a 40-year-old uh, uh, male who has noticed some thickening in the palm of his hand. Can you hazard a guess as to what you think uh, might be developing? Well, here's more established Dupuytren's disease. Can you uh, point out to me the etiological risk factors associated with uh, Dupuytren's disease? Can you tell me um, uh, what happens uh, to the neurovascular bundle if a patient has a spiral cord? Can you tell me what makes up a spiral cord? Now this patient's on your operating list and you need to take uh, informed consent. What sort of things would you write in the, uh, in the column, uh, common complications? Can you tell me the broad principles of surgery and what the different types of operation? Tell me the common uh, incisions that are used for uh, Jupiter surgery. What's a Brunner incision? What's a Z-plasty? And what would happen if uh, you perform just a simple longitudinal incision right down the length of the finger? Where else might you look in this patient to see whether they had any other evidence of, uh, of Dupuytren's disease? Okay, here's uh, his foot. What's this condition known as? Changing the subject now. This is an 18-year-old girl who's cut her finger on some glass. Describe what you see. What structures do you think may have been damaged? And how would you test for them? Okay, how would you test for the uh, digital nerve? Fine. How would you now test for FDS and FDP? Do all patients have FDS in the little finger? If you were uh, explaining this to a hand surgeon over the telephone, what zone would you tell them uh, the injury had occurred in? Tell me about the pulley systems of the finger. Post-operatively, what uh, types of rehabilitation programs are there for uh, long flexor tendon uh, um, uh, repairs? Change the subject. This is just a spot diagnosis. Here's a mother with her child. Can you tell me what the abnormality is in the little finger? Changing the subject, can you just describe this deformity to me? Can you hazard a guess as to diagnosis? Here's a radiographs. Tell me what the features of this x-ray are of osteoarthritis and what are of uh, rheumatoid arthritis. <laughs> 